everyone. In this video, we are looking at swell color. The color of your swell can be an indicator of how much organic matter is present. For swell color, all we need is a shovel and a bit of water. In addition to swell organic matter, which affects swell color, swell moisture can as well affect swell color. Therefore, we must make sure the swell is moist so that we have consistency in our result. Excavate some amount of swell and take a look at it. Is it gray in color, which tells you there is poor drainage in the swell? Add a bit of water to a handful of swell and look at the colors. Are the color dark brown or black, light brown or tan? For swell color, it will be better to compare between areas in a plot of land or in a, a feed. For example, you collect samples from different areas and compare for high performing areas in color and low performing areas in color. And you have to record whether the swell is dark brown, medium brown, light brown, or if they have any gray coloration. We have dug out some amount of swell, as you can see. The color of the swell is dark brown. And the moisture content here is high as you can see. So we do not need to add extra water. So with regard to the color and the dark brown nature, tells me that there is no sign of poor drainage here because the swell is not gray, it is dark brown. 